started about seven years ago, and it is um, the um, it's a thrift it's a thrift store. People donate clothes, furniture, shoes, purses, accessories, jewelry, and then all of the uh, proceeds that everything is sold goes into this room. battling breast cancer. We give uh, whatever the whatever the woman needs, free wigs, free prosthetics. Um, if they're going through chemo, we have chemo shawls, we have pillows for them to protect their ports. Uh, if, they, if they are gaining weight or losing weight, we um, will give them clothes, whatever they need, at no cost to them. Uh, my name is Linda Roush, and um, I have been diagnosed with stage four breast cancer. And uh, my first diagnosis was in 2006. And um, <clears throat> I went into my doctor's office, and I uh, was getting treatment. And um, a woman came in and said, "Hey, somebody wants to meet you." And so I said, "Okay." So I, uh, lo and behold, I go in there, and there's a guy standing there. Hey, my name is Brian. And I said, okay. And he goes, and look what's in my hand right here. And he had his checkbook in his hand. And he goes, I'm here to give you $1,000 for your medical bills. And I was like, what? And ever since then, you know, I've always known that I can come back to Pink Hands if I'm feeling like depressed or just anything. And they, they're just right here for me. So. There are people out there that uh, want to give money but they're afraid to give money to certain charities because they're afraid that the money is not being used properly or they're afraid that the money is being used to pay somebody's salary or to pay for rent or overhead. So a lot of people don't want to donate money to charities, which I think is wrong because there are charities such as Pink Hands of Hope that are good charities that the money that is being donated to them is money that's used to help, directly help people that are in the fight. Certainly, Pink Hands of Hope has um, it's just been an inspiration for me. It's kept me going some days, you know what I mean? And that's why I think that, you know, if you're thinking of doing any kind of donations or anything, that, that Pink Hands of Hope should be number one on your list because they really do a lot of good work for everyone.